Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Teardrops Diary and I'm Mihika. I guess you all have been waiting for my very first book review and here I am with the, with the review of Thea's Prison and the Dragon's Code. First, let me tell you something about the book. This is a book from Scholastic Publishers and its author is Elizabeth Adam, who is an Italian fiction writer. This book is fiction with mystery, adventure and lots of fun. Now coming to the plot, the setting is at an academy called Mousewood Academy on Rail Island, where Thea Stilton, a journalist, gets an invitation to teach an adventure journalism course there. There she happens to meet the headmaster and many students like five bright mouselings and a student called Hans Ratzel who seemed a bit weird. The five mouselings were Nikki, Pamela, Colette, Paulina and Violet and they became Tia's good friends and eventually partners in solving the mystery. One morning the student hands went missing. On searching, they found a book belonging to Hans on the stairs to the cellar. Thea and the five friends, on reaching the cellars, looked around for some clues. And they found an old inscription with letters behind a huge dragon fountain. With some pots and broken rake lying around. Paulina decoded the code to find out the word dragon and through some events they got to know how to open the mouth of a huge dragon statue. When they entered the mouth they fell into a water pipe which led them to a cave. When they entered the cave they stumbled on an old wrecked viking ship. When they looked around, they found Hans Ratzel, the missing student, hanging upside down. And that's why his wig and glasses fell off. Soon they realized he was actually a professor disguised as a student because he wanted to know more about Thea and explore the cellar undisturbed. So that's how Tia and her five friends solved the mystery. This book is so interactive that you feel like you're the one solving the mystery. Three things that this book teaches us are how friendship works, how teamwork always helps and that we must never give up. Along with that, we get to learn about new words, funny phrases and mystery solving techniques. When I read this book for the first time, it took me about two to three hours to finish it. But now I can read it within an half an hour. To me, the best part was when Thea and the five friends became good friends. If you found my videos interesting, please like, and share the video, my video with all your friends and cousins. And don't forget to press that subscribe button and click the notification bell so you'll be notified when new videos coming up. See ya!